I'm a dude, and I'm inviting you to join me on a podcast about brews. Does that include stouts? Yes. Yes, of course it includes stouts. Like I was saying, join us every Saturday on the journey hey, hey, into... Hey, co- wait a minute. Do you, do you guys do anything about, like, IPAs? Yes. Like that? Yes, of, yes, of, yes, we do IPAs. Okay. It's, okay. It, yes. Anyway... Join us on the Journey into Comics Network for Brews with Dudes. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, hey do you, have you guys ever, do you care if I bring some Zima on? Yes, I care if you bring Zima. Zima doesn't count. Zima, oh. Zima's, Dr. Dongo. Anyway, join us every Saturday for a podcast that delves into the craft brew world. The following is a Journey into Comics Network production. just solo right now um because i i wanted to fill you in on uh the last couple of weeks has been uh a little bit hectic so we weren't able to uh set aside our time to record our episode like we normally would uh so what we ended up doing uh just so we could get you some content still um yesterday we sat down with our kids uh you know we we had them sit down with us and while we were eating dinner we tried to kind of tried to kind of do a podcast interviewing them a little bit but uh as you'll see uh when the episode starts it it, it uh it didn't go quite as smooth as we were hoping it would um it was a little unstructured a little unorganized uh as it normally will be when you have kids as young as ours um but we kind of just wanted to give you an insight into what a family dinner is like for us um so that's that's what this episode is uh I I wanted to get all the plugs out of the way before this starts. Um, So you can find us on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram. I'm I'm still getting used to Twitter and Instagram. I'm I'm a little behind the times with that stuff. Um, Twitter and Instagram, you'll find us at Kids for Sale Pod. And I'm trying to remember what our URL is on Facebook. Uh, you can email us at uh, kidsforsalepodcast at gmail.com, um, which we would really appreciate some emails uh, or, or, or anything, really, um, regarding you know what, what you would like to hear from us, uh, ideas for episodes, uh, discussion topics. Um, if you have stories about your own kids, you can send me stories of your own kids, and, and I'll read them and... Um, you know, just so other people can get an insight into what goes on in your lives. Um, we, we would really like to start hearing from everybody, uh, just to give us an idea of which direction you want us to go. We, we've kind of been scattered all over the place over these first five episodes, uh, and we're really not sure what people are enjoying and what they're not enjoying. And, and we just love to hear some honest feedback, uh, so we can get the show moving in the right direction. So, like I said, you can, you can find us on all the social medias at, at kids for sale pod, or you can email us at kids for sale podcast at gmail.com. And as always, you can check out all the other shows on the journey into comics network. Uh, you can go to journey into comics.com, uh, and you'll find all the other great shows like, uh, poor Report and, uh, adulting ain't easy. The journey into comics podcast, which I've been on a couple episodes of, uh, foodies watching movies who just wrapped up their season two, uh, with a really epic uh, 80s movie countdown battle. Uh, they had the brackets up on Twitter and Facebook and everything, if uh, if anybody checked those out. I thought that was kind of a fun idea. Brews with Dudes, um, Voice of Survival. There's a bunch of great shows. I'm sorry for the ones I didn't mention, but uh, I'm just trying to get this intro done so I can uh, get this sent off to Nate and he can get the episode up for you to listen to. Um, so, like I said, so... Uh, ch- this episode is just us sitting with our kids and trying to have a conversation. It's a little short. Uh, I think I think we clocked in at a, around 25 minutes, somewhere in there. So um, you can just hear what 
what family life is like at our house. Uh, and you can also hear Mark being a mic hog and, and Livy being a little too shy to get involved in the show at all. Um, but we had a fun time recording it and hopefully we'll do these with our kids some more down the line. Um, but we'll try to structure them a little more. So we give you a little bit more of an entertaining episode to listen to. Um, we, we tried, we tried with this one at the last minute and, uh, and, and I feel like we got something good out of it, but it, it, uh, it could be better with a little more structure. So, um, again, after this episode, you can check us out in another two weeks and hopefully we'll have something, uh, something good for you, a, a good, good discussion or a good, uh, possibly guest. We're, we're looking at some guests coming up in the next couple, next couple episodes. I've, I've got a couple of really good ones lined up with interesting stories that I think you guys are going to want to hear. So, uh, please hit us up with questions, comments, concerns, please check out the other podcasts on the journey into comics network. Uh, and we'll see you in a couple of weeks. Thanks. Olivia. So welcome to kids for sale podcast. Uh, on tonight's episode, we decided to try to do something new. Um, we are going to let you in on our family dinner. Uh, so right now the five of us are sitting around and eating our dinner. Okay. That was Scarlett. Livy, say hi. Okay, well, that was Livy saying, mm-mm. And Hello. Mark? That was Mark. Uh, and with me still is my co-host and my wife, Ashley. Ashley, say hey. Yo. Yo. Um, the volume's going to be a little inconsistent because I've got the microphone spread out a little bit. So Dad, did everybody you say no? Hear. No. Who said, said no? yo. You said yo? Yeah. So, for tonight's dinner on the menu, we have... Someone made Whoa. some homemade pierogies. Hey, Dad. How do you That's talk jalapeno. and not? Ashley and I are eating homemade pierogies uh, that someone from her work brought in for her. Mm -hmm. um, the kids are eating their typical chicken nuggets and french fries with a packet of applesauce and a juice pouch. And, and chicken fries. And chicken fries. And... And fry fries, that's right. So, let's start with... Uh, I need those. I want those chicken fries. You, you already have You have fries. some in your basket already. Oh. Yeah, see, there you go. So, I guess we can start by talking about uh, how was everybody's day. Mark, how was your day today? Good. What would you do today? Well... I mostly played football in the hallway. Played football in the hallway. Ashley's mm -hmm. choking over there. <coughs> uh, what else did you do? Football in the hallway. Oh, you were at your mom's house today, right? Because me, me and Ashley were both at work, yeah. so yes, we had to drop you guys. Well, your mommy came and picked you up this morning, didn't she? Right. Yeah. So you were playing football in the hallway at your mom's house today. Yes. All day. Well, not all day. Well, what else did you do? I read some books. Oh, yeah? What kind of books are you reading? Well, I'm reading... Um, Taco de Noodle? Oh, my gosh. I, I don't know the titles to it. You need help, Libby? Were, were any of them, like, uh, Captain Underpants? or No, no. Or what's what's the uh, other... The, the superhero? I know the, uh, Captain uh, Underpants. Dog, dog man? Dog man. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> la, la, la. La, la, la. <laughs> Were you reading Dogman today? No. No, he wasn't reading Dogman. No. Nope. I can't tell what any of these are. Yeah, we no. we have a bunch of mystery probes. We got like six different kinds, and we don't. I just made them all at the same time, so I don't know what any of them. Who are. did? What? What did you do today at work? Well, today at work, I watch movies. No, actually, I had to drive, like, to the west Chicago suburbs today, so, and I got stuck in traffic on my way up to the city, because there was a fire uh, just off the Dan Ryan, so I was, I was stuck in traffic for, like, an hour and a half. Yikes! Yeah. yeah Yikes! That was crazy. That was hurt. Yeah. That's bad. Yeah, it was bad. It was a bad fire, actually. I'm, I'm one, I was hoping to hear on the news or the Dead. traffic report or something what it was, but it was And it was fire. scary. It was scary looking. Dead. You need me to open that, Lulu? Hey, Dad. Yes, buddy. 
Um, is that a poop was it a bridge? Uh, it, so when I was going on the highway, there was a bridge that goes over the highway, and just on the side of the bridge was where the fire was. And oh, what? And okay. it was so scary. It was so scary. So so so. But, scary. So that was that was half of my day at work today was driving to pick up some parts and driving back and getting and stuck in traffic it, both ways. And it was so 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 scary. Yeah, it's crazy. And crazy. how good is your food? My food is pretty tasty. How about yours? Good. Good chicken fries? Did I do okay? Yep. Yeah, Aldi's. That's where it's at. Aldi's chicken fries, Aldi's chicken nuggets, and Aldi's seasoned french fries. Can you help me open this thing? Yes, I can help you open your juice. Did you just say seasoned? Nope. Seasoned french fries. Seasoned mama! That's right. <laughs> How about you, Livy? What did you do today? Mm. You gonna tell me about your day? Well, she mostly watch TV. Yeah? Mm -hmm. With mommy? Uh, I would say with Sophie. Oh, with Sophie? Sophie's your cousin, right? Mm -hmm. Right. What did you do today, Scarlett? I did... Did you go to daycare today? Oh, yeah, I fell down. You fell down at daycare? And then I got boo-boo in the blood. A boo boo in the blood? Mm. Oh no. Didn't you fall down the hill the mm. other day? No. Yeah. I did. Yeah. And I. That's probably funny. Dead? Huh? Yes, Can I have more chicken? Help yourself. Thank you. Don't hog it all though. I will. Make sure your sisters get enough. How about you eat a couple of french fries too? Those french fries look pretty good. Because they are good. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Scarlett, what else did you do at daycare today besides falling down a hill and getting a bloody boo-boo? Um, hey, Dad. Nothing. Nothing, nothing? else. You, did, you didn't play with any of the kids? Uh -uh. I hey, played all by myself with Emery. Hey, hang on, Mark. Let, let Scarlett talk first. Okay. I played with Emery. You played with Emery? Emery. Emery? Was it fun? What would you guys play? Play swipe, fall down the hole. Slide, fall down the hole? No. Slide, fall down the hill. Oh, slide, fall down the hill. Yeah. That sounds like a fun game. Hey, does right, anyone even, want to listen to my guitar? Yeah, let's hear your guitar, Mark. Okay. First, I think I need to tune it. Okay. Go ahead and tune it up. Hmm. Livy, no, what did you, what did you watch on TV fine. today? Oh, that sounds like a good show. Barbie. Barbie. You watch Barbie today with Sophie? Yeah, and also, it was with a mom and dad. Oh, yeah? And, um... And what? The... The fairy movie. The fairy movie? Yeah. Was it Tinkerbell fairy movie? No. Uh, no? No. Nope. Yeah, Not at all. Not at all. All right, Mark, are you going to play us a song? Uh, no. No? I thought you were tuning your guitar up so you could play us a song. I'm not playing you a song. He I want everyone to hear me play my guitar. Okay, play. Well, that's what I mean. Are you going to play me a song on your guitar? I need a pick. Well, there's probably a pick on Jack's amp over there. Oh, did we, uh... I guess since the last episode we recorded, uh, probably actually the day that we recorded it, or the day after we recorded it, I don't remember. Uh, we the day went, after recording. We went to the shelter and we got a we got a dog. What's the dog's name, guys? Duck. Ducky. Duck. So now we have a cat named Sarah and a dog named Duck, just like that show on Netflix called Sarah and Duck. No, Quack. Sarah and Duck. Quack. Quack. Sarah and Duck. Quack. Sarah and Duck. Libby, let go. Sarah Mark, I don't know. Duck. You can't find a pick over there. I don't know, buddy. You might have okay. to play it. Sarah and Duck. Quack. There's a yellow one on the floor by the microphone stand. I'll get it. Oh, sorry for the loud thump. He bumped the mic stand with his guitar. I don't think it's a big deal. Oh. Mm -hmm. So... Mark's going to play us a song now. I am not playing you a song! Okay, he's going to play his guitar for us. <coughs> That's the first 
first one. That's the second one. That's the third one. That's the fourth one. That's the fifth one. And that's, that's the, the sixth, sixth one. one. I placed them. All right. So that's what it sounds like. It's sounding better good, than dude. your dad. You want me to play? It probably is. But well, let's sit down and eat first. Let's sit down and eat first. Libby! I think she might be going potty or something. Like that. Scarlet, no! Scarlet, please put the guitar down. You can play with the guitar after we're done eating, okay? Hey, guys. Hey, no, hey, back off of the microphone a little bit. Scarlet and Libby are not doing this anymore. Or are you going still, Scarlet? Are you going to come back and talk to us some more? Well, come okay. sit down. Why don't you tell, tell everybody what your favorite color is? Green and orange. Green and orange. How about yours, this, Mark? This is my favorite color. This is red, blue, purple, and pink. Red. And my favorite color is green, orange, pink, and purple. Libby, what are you saying back there, sweetheart? She just went upstairs and closed the door. What's my favorite color? Red and pink. Just red. Just red. Uh oh. Oh no. So. Oh no. It's okay. It's just a little applesauce. So back to the shelter. So what had actually happened was uh, there was a sale I'm sure everybody heard about. Uh, it was the Build-A-Bear pay your age day at Build-A-Bear um, where you know you bring your kids in and however old they are that's how many dollars they pay for a Build-A-Bear which if you have young kids is actually a really good sale like we we have two four-year-olds and a seven-year-old so we would have gotten three Build-A-Bears for 15 bucks which normally they're each about 20 to 30 dollars I'd say um, but uh, we got loaded up in the car to go that morning got on the highway and got stuck in traffic. Actually, thankfully stuck in traffic. Um, because while we were parked I on the highway... Now she's here. Oh. oh, okay. Well, while we were parked on the highway, uh, we kind of were l looking over Facebook and noticed that people were saying, you know, posting pictures of the line at Build-A-Bear at our, at our local mall. And the line was insane. It was wrapped halfway around the mall practically. And then we started... You know, seeing posts from the Build a Bear website that the promotion was so overwhelmingly popular that for for safety reasons they had to shut the lines down um, before most of the stores even opened. So uh, they started having security guards stand at the end of the lines and just tell people, you know, we're done for the day, no more getting in line. Hey, are you going to come back and talk on the show? Well, I'll, you can show me in a minute. I'm gonna, let me finish talking like, about the dog. You okay? Yeah. <laughs> okay, Mark. You don't have to apologize. It's fine. So uh, we were on the highway still, and we decided since we can't go to Build a Bear, we just we went diverted to the shelter uh, nearby, and uh, we went in, talked to the woman, and said, "Hey, we've got three kids at home and a cat. You know, what do you, what kind of dogs do you have that would be good for our family?" They showed us three dogs, and the first one was a little big, and and he unfortunately nipped at Scarlet just no, a little bit. He, well, he nip. didn't nip at Scarlet. He he nipped at the treat in Scarlet's hand, but his tooth caught her on the hand, and she freaked out. So that dog went away. So uh, the second one the, was the second one was really, 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 really crazy. Yeah, she was hyper. She was a spaz. She was jumping all over, and we couldn't we couldn't stop her, and. I mean, she was really sweet. She was really friendly. She liked to give kisses and stuff, but she was a little too hyper. So they brought in the third dog, and the third dog was, uh, they named her Bonnie. Uh, what are the other two? Uh, the other two. The first one was Scout. The second one was, uh, was it like hun honey, honey Bee or something? Yeah, Honey Bee. And the last one was Bonnie. She was really sweet. Bonnie was really sweet. Deceptively calm. Yes, deceptively calm, which we should have known because the girl said right up front, like, this one's going to be a little 
a little more of a spaz than the second one, which I didn't see how that was possible. But then they brought her in, and she was really calm, and she was really sweet, and she sat and gave kisses and cuddled with the kids, and and we all fell in love. So we adopted her that day and brought her home, and we renamed her from Bonnie to what did we name her? Ducky. Ducky. And that's how we have a dog now. That was two weeks ago, I think today, actually. Uh, we're recording this on Thursday because we're, you know, last minute procrastinators. Hey, do you know Five Nights at Freddy's at all? Five Nights at Freddy's? Who are you asking? Like from, from Five Nights at Freddy's, Bonnie, remember? Oh, yeah, there's a character on Five Nights at Freddy's called Bonnie. But... You're not supposed to play Five Nights at Freddy's, are you? Yep. Why not? I'll have nightmares. That's right, you'll have nightmares. It's a creepy game. I don't know if any parents out there, uh, if your kids play it, but man, it's a, it's a weird game. Uh, and Mark doesn't handle it very well, so we don't we don't play it in our house, do we? Nope. Not at all. Not at all. Libby, don't pull on Ducky's collar. Does anyone like the whip and nene? <laughs> the whip and nene? Are you going to do the dance? No. No? But I'll show you some of it. First you put your fist up and then your hand up. Fist, fist, hand. Can I take a video of that and I'll post it on the uh, Facebook so sure. people can see what you're doing? Yeah. Hang on, hang on. i got to start recording. Okay, there's Ducky, and there's Libby, and here's Mark. He's going to show us how to do the whip and nae nae. All right. Ready? One, two, three, four. Now watch me whip, watch me nae nae, watch me whip, whip, watch me nae nae. Okay, that's how you that's, do That's how you do it, huh? Mm -hmm. What are you doing back there, Liv? Doing monkey at the roof. <laughs> All right, crazy kid. I'm trying to do Let's go. So I can hurry up. This hand. Now watch me do. Watch me do. All right. But wait, Dad. I haven't showed you. Oh, well, hang on, hang on, I, 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 I Does anyone know the cha cha slide? Okay, Mark. Everybody knows these dances. You can calm down. My monkeys and the other hand. Yes. Does anyone know the Kiki challenge? Hey, Mark. Get your face away from the microphone. You don't have to talk so loud. Okay. The girls are. Yeah, we kind of lost the kids. So maybe this is where we're going to wrap up our uh, family dinner for this episode. Yep. Um, and then uh, I guess I'll do the plugs afterwards. I'll record everything later. And, uh, we'll talk. I'll, I'll tell everybody a little bit more about our last couple of weeks. Uh, but we just wanted to get the kids in on an episode. First, we were at a hotel, right, Dad? Yeah, we already talked about the hotel. That was a couple weeks ago, huh? When we went to Wisconsin Dells. Did you like yeah. Wisconsin Dells? Oh, uh, yeah. What was the best part of it? I would say the outdoor park. The outdoor water park? With the big giant yellow slide that you went down? Yep. It was so, so, so fast. Yeah? That you could whoop down. And then, and then slide like down. So much. It was like, it was and a big it, slide, but oh, it was steep. The to go yeah. And that was really, really, really yeah. scary for me. Yeah. You yeah. had to crush your arms and legs. Yeah, well, you did it. You and were, then, you were and really then, brave. And then when I crushed my arms and legs, when I went down, I put my hands up and my legs out. And I'm like, ah. <laughs> What is this ride taking me to? <laughs> so I so sit ducky. And then and then I saw the, leave the dog alone. There. I saw the part for like the bottom part. Okay. I went so fast down down that slide, right, Dad? You did. It was awesome. It scared me. I'm like <laughs> Hey Libby. What? what was your favorite part of the vacation? <laughs> Remember when we went to Wisconsin Dells a couple weeks ago? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. What was your favorite part of the vacation? Mm -hmm. Was it the water slides? 
live? Yeah. Or was it camping? Kiki. Or, hey, Mark, not right in the microphone, okay? Kiki. Kiki. Or was it when we went miniature golfing on the pirate golf? Oh, yeah, I love it. That was absolute that. torture. Or was it when we went to the wizard quest and we played the, the dragon game? Oh, yeah, that was the awesomest, awesomest game, people. Was that your favorite part, Livy? Was You couldn't watch us, people. No. You couldn't no. watch us. What was your favorite part, Livy? The water slides was your favorite Remember part? Remember what you did before the wizard quest, Mark? Yes. Well, what'd you do? I was whining. It was, a little, I was, it, was a, it was a little bit more severe than just whining. Yeah. And then I went, on, and I'm like, wow, this this part, this is not scary anymore. Mm-hmm. Well, maybe we should have had you guys on a couple weeks ago, right, when we got back, so you could have talked about it. Hey, anyway, we found four dragons. The air dragon, the... Um, Water. Water, earth, and fire. Mm-hmm. We got all the elements, and then we freed the fire dragon. That's right. Mm-hmm. Wow. Um, Beth, can you do your password? Yeah, I will do my password. I'll, okay, mm-hmm. Libby wants to play on my phone. Scarlet's done already. She's checked out. I don't know where. She's up across the basement. Yeah. Um, so we're going we're gonna to end this, uh, this portion of the podcast. Um, and we'll do this again sometime, but we'll we'll try to make it a little bit more organized. Hey, don't 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 go right into the microphone, okay? Okay, yeah, we'll try to do it a little bit more organized so it's not as chaotic. But, but this was kind of a last minute idea, and we thought it would be fun. Okay, Livy, quit laughing right in the microphone. Yeah. Okay. But wait, wait, wait. Yes, Mark. Before you stopped it, I wanted to tell the people that about the uh, no wait shadows of Mordor. Shadows of Mordor. What's Shadows of Mordor? What's a game that you had you had to kill orcs? Sometimes there's epic boxes that you had to kill. But but also the, there's a part of this game that um you can you Daddy. can turn the soldiers the armor soldiers you can turn them into your soldiers. Oh yeah. And and then there's this other thing there's there's this thing on the side, and and um when when you when you press to the side, then then you'll put your hand up, and then and then there's going to be five orcs without armor. Oh okay. Mm-hmm. Well, but is that your bosses are really hard to fight, so you should watch out for the bosses if you're playing Shadows of Mordor. Watch out for the bosses. If you're playing Shadows of Mordor. And that's where we're going to leave you for today. You guys want to say bye? Bye, man. Bye. Bye. Starlight. Bye, bye everyone. Bye, Scarlet. everyone bye. who wants wait, to wait, hear wait. this. Scarlet, do you want to come say bye? No, Scarlet, you're not going to come say bye? All right, Ashley, you have to say bye. 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 Adios, amigos. Bye. All right, go ahead and say bye.